Hi everybody, you're back in my kitchen again. I'm doing some fish, I'm doing some flounder. I'm gonna pan fry my flounder in butter and, uh, and a little bit of, of um, ve vegetable oil. But it's a 10 minute, 10 minute quick dinner. Uh, especially when it's warm outside, you don't wanna, well it's not even if it's warm outside. You just don't wanna be cooking all day. This is one of those quick dinners I make often, okay? Thank you everyone for um, subscribing and being with me and hanging on and um, keep on subscribing, keep on thumbs up, keep on commenting, keep on ch asking me whatever questions you like. I appreciate your, you guys hanging out with me. Okay, I'm going to get into this. Okay, I have right now on the stove, I have um, just enough oil at, in, in my pan to um, cover the bottom. It's not a lot. And I'm just getting it hot. Plus, I put about a half a stick of butter in there, so so it'll it'll work out well. Okay, I have a pound of flounder fillet that I already uh, that I already seasoned, and I seasoned it with some fresh dill. But I often use this dill, you know, which is fine. I use some uh, some lemon pepper, no salt. I use uh, a little bit of Old Bay on each side, just a little bit. Because Obey is salty. And um, a little onion powder. And for my seasonings, I use this. Uh, one of them is just like a bread crumb. And one of them is kind of crispy. So I, I mix them together. And I have them in. I have them right here. That's the, what I bread it with. And I have two eggs in my bowl. So watch what I'm doing. By the time I'm here, that should be nice and hot. Okay, so... Take the flounder, then we just coat it in the egg mixture, and then we coat it in the flour. I know people use different hands with this, but I don't. It's sort of a pain. I just wash my hands. That's big, no big deal. Everything's going in the same place. No big deal. Okay. And I'm going to put it in the frying pan. Yeah, it's getting ready. There we go. And when I stand over here anyway, I'm right next to the water. I could just rinse my hand off. Not a problem. Put the next one in. And I'll bring you back when I'm when I finish when I got everything in the pan. So my, my fish has been frying and um, you want to wait until it gets brown on around the edges basically and then you know it's about ready to turn it over which it's almost there. Um, I got this recipe, first time I did it I probably was about 14 and my sister showed me how to, how to pan fry some flounder and she used um, the egg and she used uh, just regular uh, all purpose flour and it really was good back then and so I just kind of perfected it a little bit the way I like it but I, I thank you Francis for that um, for that recipe and I have been telling Dottie and she was a co-worker of mine she has moved on to a new job but I was telling Dottie that uh, this is how I make it so this is for Dottie and Dylan so you guys can also know how to do this I'm sure that Dylan's going to tell Dottie that, she, that he saw this and Dylan is um, Dottie's uh, son, and he's going to tell his mother he saw this. So, that either she can make it or he can make it. So, you see that it got brown. I can see it got um, brown on the side, and you can see that it's really brown on one side. And I said that this has been like this uh, for maybe, maybe three minutes, four minutes on one side. This fish doesn't take long at all to make, so it should be done in about within two minutes. In fact, I'll put my timer on for two minutes, and I say it should be done, and I can put the rest in. OK, 
Okay, it's been on for two minutes. I'm gonna, let's put this off. Okay, so this side should be nice and brown. I have a plate here. I'm gonna stick it on there. Yep, it came out beautiful. Beautiful. Yes, there you go. Yep, nice. Okay, I'm gonna do this. You look pretty, pretty good too. You see how pretty these are? And I would say that you're done now. Okay. Here we go. Now this is my flounder. And it's cooked in butter, pan fried in butter and dill. And it has a nice coating. Um, a crunchy and and and, uh, and uh, floury coating, and it's pretty good. I will leave the recipe at the bottom. I'm gonna eat this a little bit later. I know it's good. I always make this. I can smell it. it still smells delicious. So, but I'm gonna make um, leave the recipe at the bottom, so you guys can enjoy. All right. Thank you all for coming, watching my videos, and keep coming. All right. You guys have a good day. Thank you. Bye bye.